Libra, welcome. This is your daily tarot card reading. It's for Friday, but it is divinely timed. Um, and it's for Libra. If you have Libra anywhere in your chart, you may resonate. So let's get into the energy for you. Let's see what message we are getting. <laughs> okay, Libra, 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 Libra. Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. You know, have fun. <laughs> They're saying to you, have fun, enjoy, enjoy everything, the simple pleasures in life. Um, because it's cultivating a very beautiful energy around you that's making you very attractive. Right, let's see what else we get. Mm. Right. You've got two cards here. There's a death card that kind of just fell out. Okay, so this is like a renewal. Okay, there's an ending here. I feel like, Libra, you were on this timeline and it just wasn't working. And you know the most amazing thing? Because we're multidimensional beings. <laughs> Sometimes we can just change change our energy and just shift timelines and completely turn things around because everything's our own mental projection. Um, and you've got here this other energy, which is scared to look at what's going on. <laughs> really scared. But then actually, do you know, when she looks at what's really happening and takes that courage, realises there's actually nothing to be frightened or worried about. So it's quite interesting. So there's a lot of illusion. There's a lot of illusion going on because even in this card, it's an illusion. Because death is an illusion. There's no birth, there's no death. Okay, not in not in the spirit realm. And um, it, that's why death is actually renewal. Hmm. So let's go a bit deeper for Libra. Libra. Hmm. Yeah, this is what I feel. I honestly feel you're turning a situation around. <laughs> a whole 180. Because... Somebody wasn't giving you what you deserved. This is very unfair. Not receiving what you deserved and it wasn't working out. Um, you've been waiting for an apology, uh, waiting for a reunion, wondering what, when's it going to happen, you know? Now the good news is, it's super, super fun. Success. You're going to be victorious. Um, you're an absolute match here for somebody. An absolute match, but... I feel like you both got onto a timeline and it wasn't working. And all you have to do is just shift the energy and shift the point of attraction energetically. You know, look at, look at your person. I feel like you're doing it already and you're going to do it because you're going to be successful. This is victory and it's also one of the marriage cards in the deck. Um, now, if you shift... No, if you look at your person, you know, you know them better than anybody else. And you know how to, um, you know what they like, okay? You know, and if it's not a person, if it's a opportunity, you know how to line up with it energetically. You know how to attract it. I know anyone that watches my channel has this type of energy and ability, you know, and sometimes we just get blocked because of emotions. Once you clear those emotions out of the way, which I feel you have on that full moon eclipse we just had, I feel like you've already cleared out your energy that was blocking you. Now you can see more clearly. Now you can get back in the driver's seat. You can look at this person or look at this situation and say, right, I know I'm a match because you are. I'm telling you, you're a match. And all you have to do is line up your energy with them in the way that you know is going to work for them, yeah? And that's how you then link into it. And then it will come to you. And this is what's going to happen because you are going to be the point of attraction. So, hmm, yeah, you are. Your person's got the page of cups. Somebody's going to make you an offer. Somebody's going to either write you an offer or they're going to um, make you an offer because they are super excited. Now, you could be, um, you've been waiting for this. I know you have, I can see this in the cards. Um, but uh, forget about that now. 
forget about the old energy just be very present because you can just <laughs> you know we're multi-dimensional beings you can just because this is all written out predestined already by the way that's why it, that's the main reason it will work um you're just you've just been delaying the whole thing because you had energy that was blocking it and i'm not putting all the blame on you but you know sometimes we do that ourselves <laughs> So let's see what your person's thinking. I kind of know what they're thinking, but... Okay, I can't let go of the past. So they blocked things with you because of their past, but also I don't think they can really just shut you out like they thought they could <laughs> emotionally. Now, they're going to start something new up with you. Um, this person is, you know, basic. I do feel like this is somebody you already know. I do feel like that. But obviously it's a collective reading. So maybe some of you will be attracting new love because we've got the Law of Attraction card there. Um, we've got the Page of Cups, which can be new love. But I think for a lot of you, this is renewal because of the Death card, you see. Um, and I just feel somebody was blocking the connection because of their fear, because of issues from the past, because of old energy that needed to be released. I feel that's all been released now. And this is a fresh start. Now, it's going to be exciting. Like I said, you could be exploring sexuality with this person, exploring spirituality. It's going to be really fun. But just keep remembering to guard your heart because Page of Cups is just so... In fact, I think this person guards their heart. I think they guard their heart because um, they were hurt in the past. So they know that they can sometimes fall quite hard for someone else and they're frightened of that happening um wait it is not yet time things are being woven that's the card from the spirit guides so things are being woven you're going to be successful you're going to have victory all you've got to do is take one energetic step at a time one energetic step at a time libra you're going to do this all right law of attraction even though i don't really believe in law of attraction it's more to do with just your energy honing in on that opportunity or person and working out how can i line my energy back up and put the past in the past okay um so that's the message thank you for subscribing thank you for supporting and uh, if you'd like to book in i'm here just contact me i'm sending you lots of love lots of peace across gaia